Hey, Ronald, can you please lend me your stapler? I think I've lost mine. Hello, Thomas. Sure. I think I have that over there. Let me look for it. Thank you, bro. You know, I always lose those things. I'm a scatterbrain. <laughs> I know. Hey, did you hear about the new boss we will have for this year? New boss? No, I haven't heard about that. What is he like? Do you know? I have no idea. I mean, I haven't talked to him yet, but I saw a picture of him yesterday. Really? Show me, show me. I want to know what our new boss is like. Yeah, I had a newspaper yesterday. It had his picture on it. But where is it? I will have to look for that. Sorry, but he seems to be a strict person. We have to be careful. Be careful? <laughs> Why should I have to be careful? Don't you know me or what? I know exactly what you are like. That's why I'm telling you to be careful. Be careful, Thomas. <laughs> nah, I don't care who the new boss is. I will keep working as usual. I know, but don't say those things you usually say in front of him. Not until we get to know him well. We have already had two bosses in church here, and they never noticed. Don't worry. I'm just warning you. You've been so lucky until now, but someday that could change. Oh, you're saying that because I arrived late many times this last year? They never found out. Yeah, and also because you like to go out during working hours. We are not allowed to do that. Yeah, so what? I do whatever I want to do here. I've been doing that for many years. That's why I'm telling you that. You've been so lucky until now. That won't last forever. <laughs> no matter who comes to rule this office, he will be my friend too. You'll see. If you say so. Oh, I remember now. I lent Rosemary the magazine today. Do you still want to meet the new boss? Or you prefer to wait until he comes? I'm curious now. Go bring that magazine. I want to meet my new friend. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll be right back. I'll just ask Rosemary to give it me back. Sure, take your time. A new bus? <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> Good morning. Have you seen Ronald? I need him to tell me something. Uh, I'm the new... Hello! Who the hell are you? I've never seen you over here. Who are you? Oh, I'm really sorry. My name is Julian Preston. I arrived this morning. So now I... Julian? That sounds like the name of a janitor. You must be new here, right? Actually, yeah, as I was telling you, I arrived this morning, so I don't know the office well. Oh, don't worry, Julian. Here I am. 
I will explain you everything, okay? Seriously. And you are... Uh, sorry, but I didn't hear your name. I'm Thomas. Thomas Paris. And I'm the person in charge here, in this office. You're the person in charge? Isn't that supposed to be the boss or the supervisor? Who, Leo? Or that new boss the company is sending to rule this office? <laughs> no, no. I'm the only one in charge here. That new boss must be an idiot for sure. An idiot? Why do you say that? Do you know him? Have you met him? No, but it's not necessary. He's an idiot. Like the other bosses we had here, they're all the same. And why is that? Did they do a bad work? Did they make mistakes or what? Mm, I'm not sure, but I'll tell you a secret. You can do whatever you want in this office. You can leave whenever you want and at any time of the day and whatever you want. But we can't do that. We need to respect the office rules, right? Am I wrong? Office rules? <laughs> they never existed for me. I always leave early. And not only that, I go to my house to have lunch and then come back and nobody notices. Also, I arrive late every day. But I enter my office through the back door. <laughs> that way, nobody sees me when I do that. I'm so smart. You can do the same. Well, maybe. But if I do that and the boss finds out, I could be fired, right? Didn't you hear what I said? The bosses here are so stupid. They never notice. Look, I can even drink alcohol and smoke in this office. And they will never find out, bro. But you can't do that. It is forbidden to drink alcohol or to smoke inside the building. So what? I do that anyway. Nobody tells me what to do or what not to do. Last day, I brought my girlfriend here. We were making out in my office. <laughs> Your girlfriend? Making out? We're not allowed to bring strangers to the office. She's not a stranger. She's my girlfriend. Although, she's not the only girl I brought here. <laughs> you know what I mean. Anyway, we can even make parties here. Parties? Uh, how is that possible? This is an office. We work here. Everything is possible. It's just a matter of organizing well. That's it. I made a big party for my birthday two years ago. Beers, cake, girls, music. It was amazing. Of course, we did it after the boss left. That idiot didn't notice he had forgotten the keys. So we just came here hours later and started the party. <laughs> he was so stupid. I see. And do you always do those things since you came here? 
No, no, the first year I was like quiet. I worked hard and arrived punctual. But then the second year I started having fun. That's why we're here, right? Life's short. Aham, uh -huh. life is short, but we came here to work, not to have fun or to make parties. What happens is that you are so boring. But don't worry, I will show you how it works. We'll make a party today. I'll call some girls and then we'll dance and drink beer tonight. Oh. But it will have to be after the new stupid boss leaves. I'm sure he will leave early today. Since it's his first day, he will just come and check some things. Then he'll leave. I see. You know a lot about how the boss works here. That's surprising. Of course. I have been studying them, <laughs> so I can make my move. I told you, I can do whatever I want and nobody will tell me anything. Come on. Thomas, I see you have already met Mr. Preston. And nice to meet you, Mr. Preston. Yeah, but Mr. He's the new janitor. I was explaining him about the rules and... Wait a minute. You, you are the new boss, right? Julian Preston? The new boss? Yes, I am the new boss. And you are Thomas. I had heard about you before. Come to my office right now, please. I hope you liked this conversation. If you could improve your English a little more, please subscribe to the channel and share this video with a friend. And if you want to support this channel, you can join us or click on the super thanks button. Thank you very much for your support. Take care.